3 to 9 percent of CSEP recommendation and what we finally seen is pretty much what the street expected. All right. Uh, thank you very much, Manisha, for uh, joining us. Let's uh, move on now. India's rural markets and the mass entry level segment is hurting across categories. Rising prices of everything from food to daily essentials and even fuel is pinching the wallets of rural households. Shilpa Rani Peta reports on the impact of inflation on rural households. Inflation is biting rural India harder than the cities. The latest consumer price inflation data shows rural India continued to see steeper inflation in September at 7.56% as against 7.27% in urban and overall retail inflation of 7.41%. In the smaller town and the Bharat, or the, the, the real Bharat where 70% of our population lives, I think, you know, people who earn between 15,000 to 30,000 rupees per month, for them, uh, inflation has really taken a uh, lot of beating and given them a great stress on their budgets. According to data from retail intelligence platform Bizom, sales in rural India fell 14.3% in September. Companies like Parley, Marico, Dabur and Godrej Consumer too have indicated liquidity pressures and down trading in rural markets. Similar trends were also seen in automobiles and consumer durables where entry-level products are seeing a decline in volume. Smartphones too are seeing bumper sales on the premium end while budget smartphones are seeing a decline. Below 10 rupee price point contributes to almost more than 65-70% to our portfolio and that's quite significant and uh, uh, definitely as a, uh, from rural market we've seen that this is sort of slowed down. In addition, a severe heat wave followed by erratic monsoons have made matters worse. Northern and northeastern states like UP, Bihar and Bengal recorded a deficit monsoon this year impacting crop output. This could lead to food prices continuing to be at elevated levels. UP, Bihar, Bengal and uh, Jharkhand, these four states now there is a new theme, right? Uh, although there is a deflation say in fertilizer or say diesel, the new issue is because of a uh, deficit of rainfall of 20-30%, the uh, rice output will be impacted and in general, agri output in these four states will be impacted. Experts are now keenly watching the festive season for signs of a recovery in demand. With some commodity prices too showing signs of easing, experts say that there could be a recovery in the second half of this fiscal. According to Morgan Stanley, rural demand is set to rebound, helped by wider reopening, improving labour market conditions and improving terms of trade for the rural sector. In Mumbai, Shilparani Peta.